Similar to these were first heard during the early Renaissance period, a sound so extraordinary that could not help but spark a curiosity for what was to come, a curiosity which led to centuries of musical discovery, to an evolution of sound. Simple, haunting chords shaped the perspective people gained of early music. With each century, notes became more complicated, single compositions could last for 45 minutes, and chords with all four strings would be played. But that's the beauty of it. This was all the result of just a few first simple tones. Bach composed music so inconceivable that when playing one note, even the slightest out of tune, could echo through an entire hall. Composers like William Kroll were crazy enough to combine two instruments into one piece. Banjo and fiddle, for example, starts out with the plucking of strings and then slowly easing into double stops. And that's what I'm going to play for you today. these composers went outside of their boxes introducing new concepts, new techniques, 
even a new language, that people would then turn this phenomenon into what it is today. Over 18 million people play an instrument in the US alone, providing them with discipline, opportunity, and careers. That unfamiliar sound people first heard led to risks composers took, discoveries they made, in masterpieces, led to the evolution of music. Thank you.